For the first time in 95 years, the Kiev Police Academy has hundreds of young female cadets among its ranks. During the swearing-in ceremony, young male and female cadets performed military drills, one cadet told us. Every day we worked hard to prepare for the oath ceremony. We trained every day. At first I thought the drill-purpose rifle was a bit heavy, but now I'm used to it. Many of the young men and women at the square have been working hard to one day become police officers. We met one young man whose father was a career officer in the security forces for nearly 20 years. After retirement, he volunteered to serve in war-torn eastern Ukraine. Now his son wants to continue his father's legacy. I remember wanting to become a serviceman when I was a little boy. This is why I enrolled in Kiev's military college. But after thinking about everything, I decided to follow in my father's footsteps. Mihailo's whole family has come out to support him on his big day. I'm very proud of my son and I believe this is my husband's and my biggest achievement. Ukraine's Ministry of Internal Affairs has announced that the first stage of the country's police force has been completed. Thousands of law enforcement officers daily display courage and loyalty. They selflessly keep our society safe and in peace. Out of 600 graduates of the academy this year, more than 50 of them are serving in the combat zone. The Ukrainian government has been working to overhaul its police force since 2015. The road has been difficult, especially in changing people's perceptions. After nearly three years, results are starting to show. We've received a certificate issued by the United Nations Organization for Training Police Officers. Today we are changing the old teaching methods. We pay great attention to training. There are different training techniques and we also involve international experts. Meanwhile, more and more hopefuls are applying to become police cadets. Learn in good faith in order to one day perform your duties professionally as part of a 140,000 strong police force.